Let's find the perimeter and area of this figure. And to find the perimeter, we need to find some unknown lengths here. Notice this is given to be 23 inches, and this is given to be 6 inches. I'm just looking at horizontal lengths right now, or measures. So that's 23, that's 6. I can use those two measurements to find this length. 23 minus 6 is 17, so this is 17 inches. And then let's find one more length of this segment. How can we find the length of this segment? This is 11 inches. This is 7 inches. 11 minus 7 leaves 4 inches. And now we can find the perimeter. Perimeter is simply distance around. So the perimeter here will be 23, I'll write the inches in a moment, plus 7, plus 17, plus 4, plus 6, plus 11. If you find that sum, it is 68, so the perimeter is 68 inches. Now let's find the area, and that will be the area enclosed. To find the area, I'm going to divide this into two rectangles. You can divide it this way or this way. I'll divide it that way. So area is going to be this area plus this area. Let's find this area. This area is simply a rectangle, length 23, with 7, so 23 times 7, then I'll add to it the area of the smaller rectangle on top, which is 6 times 4. This is the area of the larger rectangle plus the area of the smaller rectangle. So if I multiply here, I'll have 161, here 24, and then if I add those two areas, 161 plus 24, that equals 185, and that is what? Square inches. The area is 185 square inches.